right, fam. I'm sure you guys have seen this by now. Uh, this is nothing new. I believe MCT leaked a couple shots of this a little while back. Nevertheless, we've got new pictures, new details, new specs. Shout out Stan the Man for the tip. Shout out Tools by Design over on Insta for the leaked pics. What you're looking at here is the DCF 850. It is the brand new quarter inch brushless impact driver from DeWalt. No, it won't be 18 volt. These are overseas picks, I'm guessing. Uh, it looks like it'll still retain the tri-beam LED. Single hand collet, no quick eject on this one. Um, I'm, I don't think it's gonna be XR, and I'll tell you guys why in a minute. Nevertheless, we've got some nice, cool looking uh, job site pictures there for you. Now let's get into the deets. Right off the bat, let's uh, let's start here. This is going to be an atomic version. Now don't freak out, don't freak out, don't get scared. Team Ketchup isn't gonna be rubbing their nuts in your face all day. Because <laughs> believe me, I'm, I'm pretty sure all of you mustard guys are tired of getting smoked out, pun intended. This is going to be a three-speed manual select impact driver. And yes, I know it's atomic, but it will have the torque to match the 887 in that tiny, tiny body. So it'll be small, but it'll pack a punch. And let me bring y'all's attention to the DeWalt Atomic 20 volt half inch cordless brushless compact impact wrench. I don't have the torque numbers for this yet, but I'm being told this is comparable to the brand new 12 volt version. It's essentially the same tool, you just swap out a battery. But what I'm most excited about, I know everybody hates buying more batteries and batteries and batteries. Eventually they wear out, this and that. You gotta buy them for the expanded capabilities, all that nonsense. Well, the Walt Herd. And they're coming out with a power stack DCB P034 5 amp hour lithium ion battery. I'm still trying to wrap my mind around this. It's some kind of power pack pouch. I'm being told it's expandable. How that works, I'm not entirely sure. I know you guys can see this gray here at the bottom. It looks like a rubber overmold. I don't know if you can connect battery to battery this way, but I don't know. Maybe y'all can figure this out. They were kind of vague on this. I'll put the description for this battery in the description down below and y'all can have a shot at it. But that's it for now, fam. Those are my thoughts. Mic drop. Have at it. Good luck.